Orthodox rabbis are coming up with some unorthodox ways of serving their south of market community in San Francisco. That's right. Sharon Chin introduces us to this week's Bay Area Jefferson Award winners. That's right. We have a father and son. We have Rabbi Yosef Langer and Rabbi Moshe Langer, and they find creative ways to spread kindness and build community. You might hear the two rabbis blowing the ram's horn trumpet called the shofar for a special occasion. Can we blow a little, uh, make a little music? But most of the time, Rabbi Yosef Langer and his son, Rabbi Moshe Langer, are serving side by side in San Francisco. This is a, a thoroughfare from downtown all the way through the town, and people are screaming in the streets. So we found it very important to be here and to be able to service. The community. The main ingredient that we put in our chicken matzo ball soup is love. Every week, Rabbi Moshe leads the Giving Kitchen, which cooks free food for dozens who are elderly and unhoused. It's hot, very hot. Volunteers pack up homemade matzo ball soup. Let me get an empty, uh, empty box. And donated hygiene kits. <laughs> right? You're a UX. I think so. <laughs> to give to their south of market neighbors in need. We got hot chicken matzo ball soup. Do you like some? Rabbi Moshe started the program in 2018, motivated by his father's kindness on a hot day. And a guy was on the floor basically begging for water. And my father, like, walked back, took time out of his day, and brought him water, a simple cup of water. That guy came back afterwards, and he told my father, he said, you saved my life. A smile and a wink and a good morning goes a long way in this world. And, and people don't forget. They don't forget it. It's really special. You see that you really could make a person's day save their life. You never know. On this day, a group of sales force employees called Faith Force volunteers passing out hot soup to unhoused people like Rodney. I mean, it means a lot to me. Yep. And Rabbi Moshe's leadership means a lot to volunteer Karen Fossler. He inspires other people to want to to be like him, to, to do good deeds. But Rabbi Moshe draws inspiration from his father. Aspire to try to be like him in his creativity to touch people and to uh, get the community together. Good to meet you. God bless you. In fact, Rabbi Yosef has been instrumental in starting and supporting Chabad's in Northern California. He founded the Chabad of San Francisco in 1980, one of the first Chabad centers in the state, a focal point of community connection, conventional or not. Are you watching the game tonight? I wish I could have somewhere to watch the game. For example, the rabbis and their staff throw an annual Super Bowl party for people living with homelessness. But the pair also cooks up innovative ways to share their Jewish heritage. Their motorized mitzvah cable car has offered tours and prayer services for the last 16 years. You want to ride? Perform a random act of kindness. In addition, Rabbi Yosef has earned the nickname Rally Rabbi for blowing the shofar for San Francisco Giants games on Jewish Heritage Nights. And that giant menorah every year on Union Square? Rabbi Yosef started that in 1975 with music promoter Bill Graham, the first public menorah lighting outside Israel. We got gold, blue and gold. Yeah. <laughs> so for serving their south of market neighborhood and highlighting their Jewish heritage, this week's Jefferson Award in the Bay Area goes to Rabbi Yosef Langer and Rabbi Moshe Langer. Well, the rabbis are fundraising to buy a ferry boat. They want to call it, what else? Noah's Ark on the Bay. They'll give educational yes. environmental tours, and plus they're going to have community events. They are fundraising right now, so we'll see what happens. I no love these guys. I want to go on that boat. I want to go on the cable car. I, I want to be, I want to hang out with them for a day. Yes. Oh, they're so much fun. They're I was, great. I was curious, what is that horn that they're, is it a, is it a shell? That's a shelf, a shell far. It's, um, it's like a ram's horn and typically, oh. you know, blow for ceremonies, but, you know, they're out doing it for Giants games and Warriors uh -huh. games and birthdays. Celebratory. And, yeah. That sort of stuff. That's oh. great. Their characters oh, are lovely. They are fun. We've yeah. fallen in love with them. All right, All right. Thanks, Sherry. <laughs> well, you can nominate your local hero for a Jefferson Award online at kpix.com slash hero. And stay